I am a PhD student and have done extensive scientific research for years on iris implants along with other cosmetic surgeries that change eye color having a clear idea of their pros and cons. I have seen such videos and paper on cases with complications of another implant used in Panama which Bright Ocular warns about also not having done. I also noticed a handful of videos of removal out of thousands of successful surgeries worldwide which is a good indicator that it is relatively safe surgery comparing to other procedures. There was a publication paper study collected a case from each country of patients that had surgery in Panama using a different implant that surgeons that perform bridocular. It clearly showed the complications that occur with the procedure. However, if doing a study on bridocular in the future in such a manner, the study needs include what are the pre-operative criteria were they followed, what implantation technique was used, who were the surgeons and how competent were they, did the patient follow the protocol and how early on after a hint of a problem were implants removed, how were implants removed and did the surgeon have experience removing. What about all the thousands of patients being supported and treated by doctors all around the world with no complication? This would be included in the scientific study, not only bad cases being selected. The study, however, was very informative and prevented me from traveling to Panama Center where those implants are used. My understanding of medicine is that everything has an incidence of problems or complications and this does not mean people have to stop it. The absolute safety are on the paradise and no absolute safety on this earth it is like using cars or using ships or using fire or anything that might harm and is usually useful cosmetic contact lens has their own complications rate routine lasik surgery and cataract surgery has complications even with beth's hands these complications and their rate is published and well known explanation of many types of intraocular lenses has happened many times and were published Responsible doctors prepare an informed, well-written consent for all the bad possibilities that they explain it for patients and they sign like I did. People know that it might be explanted and complications might occur. People who are hesitant should keep away from surgery. I noticed some people saying they did not know the risks but they are right on the FAQ page and when you email Bright Ocular, they are on the PDF file. Then when you meet the doctor, you sign a surgery consent form. This is three times you see the risks but some people People are saying they never knew the risks. People need to be smart and read all the information because they should take a better decision. There are many people who have a strong motivation to change their eye color like me and if we are aware of the risks, nothing should stop us from having the procedure. Besides more advanced off-label cosmetic artist implants now being used around the world, there are also off-label lasers and corneal tattooing eye color changing methods being performed around the world, gaining momentum as well, but like any cosmetic or medical procedure, none is risk-free. Thanks for your time. This is my opinion from my scientific observation and absolutely should not be taken as medical advice nor should you try to take medical advice from happy or unhappy patients on the internet because both can possibly be biased.